What is going on, everyone? We are back with another music reaction. I am the depraved one. I'm Hellcat. And together we are... Hella Depraved. Yes, we are. Uh, yeah. We're Naomi. back with Neoni. Followed me on Twitter. Yeah, you suck. Badly. But I still love them. They're an amazing duo, and I've yes. loved everything that we've heard from them so far. This is their newest one. Just, what, two weeks? Maybe? A week yeah. and a half? Like I don't know. Out. We're we're behind for multiple reasons. I'm point. working my ass off. That is one of the reasons. So we're here as soon as we could be, and yeah. I'm excited about it. Uh, yeah, definitely super excited about this. Um, so we're gonna react to this. If you guys have already seen it, if not, click the link in the description below. Hop on over, do all the things, like sub, comment, you know, all the fun stuff, and then come on back. And we say that because we're a commentary reaction breakdown comedy channel, and what that means is we will pause for any and or all of the above. Correct. It is time to slice it and break it down. This is Naomi with a Sanctuary. Let's get it. Let's get it. <laughs> yep, yeah, I like that bass. Hell, or the heaven can't help me now. Better run and find some hallowed ground. I'm in over my head, I'm in over my head And when I take a breath, I drown As my fountain of you dries out Feel a thousand years older now Panic over fast, sleep as nights under my bed, yeah And could you... Hell yeah But why I are really you like sleeping this. under your bed? It is so much more comfortable on top of the bed Yeah, with a but blanket if over you're you. hiding from, from shit you can't hide from old age. Well, it depends. No, she she felt older because of whatever she's gone through. Oh. Yeah. Feel a thousand years older now or something like that. So. Yeah. But I liked it because it was an enclosed <clears throat> space, not necessarily a, like I needed a safe space in my own home, luckily. Um, although I did need a hidey hole from my sister and such. Right. And I would take a light... And blankets, and A, the heating vent was under there. I was always cold. So blankets over the heating vent was my favorite thing to do. And read. And then, you know, people coming into my room wouldn't see me right away. Right. And I was very, very good with that. Everybody left me alone. Yeah, well... Siblings, parents. You, but you had one sibling that was way older than you. True. No younger siblings at all. You, you had a parent that worked, you know, and, and that, that... Although, my brother did like to do this weird thing whenever I would fall asleep. He would wrap me up in my blanket and take me to another room in the house and leave me there, and I'd wake up wondering how the fuck I got where I was at. That's kind of funny, though. It is. That's very funny. I'd wake up in the bathroom like, why am I in the bathroom? <laughs> yeah, no, that's, that's not the kind of sibling relationship that I had. Or he'd wait for me to drink something. And no matter what, when I was in the middle of drinking something, he could just say anything and I would fucking laugh and it would all come out of my nose. It wouldn't even come out of my mouth. It would that's, come out of my that's nose. That's special. That's special. That's a talent. That's an older sibling talent. Too. It hurt. <laughs> I swear that if there was a stage where I could make my sister laugh about anything. I don't remember if it all came out of her nose, but some did. But there was a stage that I had that effect as well. I, I mean, after that, I think it was just uh, crying, but you know. That's how our relationship went. <laughs> right. One or the other of us. Panic over first, sleep as nights under my bed, yeah. And could you give me something for the pain? I'm feeling more than I can say. So start rapping. See, everywhere I go, it's my sanctuary because I have trained my demons to form a circle around me. Protection? Yes. Right. Right. Face outwards, right? Right. Yeah. Like Eminem said, well, actually, technically, Rihanna, I'm friends with the monster that's under my bed. Yeah, me too. But I haven't trained them. Oh. She get on that. 
No, I kind of like them loosen off their leash. Oh. I mean, that works too. That's how we get along. <laughs> right. I really like this because this yeah, chorus like... actually took them into the more powerful and higher octave in their voices that display just how good a vocalist they are. Because sometimes where we've heard them has been in more of like the head voice pocket and they sound amazing but you can't tell exactly how powerful they are until they hit right stuff like this where do i start it's like i'm fighting sharks deep in the depths under the rest i need to rest or maybe just a second to catch my breath something here is contagious i fear i'm losing my aim and if i do i won't make it this monster was once on a leash but now i think it's gotten free That's the mm. fucking double. <laughs> Do you pray? Huh? Which part? <laughs> the I, I would rather live in a fantasy. Can somebody please pray for me? <laughs> hmm. It's like, I don't even believe in heaven or hell, but I could totally use something right. at this point. A little bit of... Yeah, I am um, more the kind that's like, well, that's not... Can you actually do something useful? I don't know. Please. I like it. She's like, what did she say? She, she said, uh, used to have my demon on the leash. Right. And then it got and free. And now it's got free. And like for me, I think of it as like, well, this is going to be fun. <laughs> well, but see, that's what I'm saying. Like in terms of training them, keeping them on a leash, whatever. <laughs> to me, that's not any way to live because either, yeah, you have those times that you're just like, fuck around and try, which I always feel that way. Or like her, where she gets afraid when they get free, and I'm like, nah. Nah. I, I, I feel like... Just now be I'm friends not, with them, you know? I'm not saying either of these ladies particularly. Right. Um, but I feel like, as a people, we're so afraid of giving in to the darker recesses within our mind. Right. Because we're afraid of what it could possibly... Honestly, we're afraid to show our ugly. Turn us into? I'm sorry, but, like, everybody has to be, like, bred one way, led one way, live a certain life one way. Like, you know, it's... it's Nobody's supposed to have demons, and when we talk about them, it's all hush-hush, and it's like... That's not... Nobody is built like that. Nobody is perfection. It's not the Stepford Wives. And even if it were, they were fucking robots, y'all. Like, it's it's gonna happen. You're gonna have bad days. You're gonna... It, it's all about how you deal with it. You're you know, gonna tell not... people they suck sometimes. Well, but it's also about... You can have bad days and you can be emotional and, and you can be shitty as long as you know you have learned to deal with it and you're not shitty inappropriately to the wrong people or you know when you're talking about letting go with your darker thoughts or whatever you know it, it, you're not harming other people we're not promoting violence on this channel you know we're not no Cause not in the cuz i was going to say sometimes you just got to stab a motherfucker right or a tree or Sharpen your knives in case, you know, the day comes. The British have it all right. Correct. Um, but <laughs> I won't go with all. But no, we're, we're afraid of being different. Uh, and it's always described as edgy or we, dark we or We being emo humanity. We definitely not being us. <laughs> yeah, probably not. Probably not. Like, I'm sitting here in a coffin. Cancel me! God I'm damn it. I'm sitting here in a coffin dress. You're sitting there in horror characters. And we're like... Stab a motherfucker. <laughs> into We're a tree. We're not promoting Here, we'll violence. combine those. Okay? Stab somebody into a tree. Oh, sleeping bag method. Jason Definitely. Vorties if you're going for a tree. <laughs> okay. We should probably get back to this. Um, Yeah. It sounds amazing. I love this song. I actually And really I know like a couple people that need to hear this at this point. Yeah. yeah. Could somebody pray for me?
can't help me now Better run and find some hallowed ground I'm in over my head, I'm in over my head And when I take a breath, I drown As my fountain of you dries out Feel a thousand years older now Panic over fresh, sleepless nights under my bed, yeah Sanctuary I love how they pulled the instrumental and just left the beat there. And then when they came back with the bass, they actually shook the image on the screen every time it hit. They're like, yeah, we know this is a nice beat. Um, as far as overall sound, this is probably my new favorite Naomi song. Right. I love the sound of this song. Now, yes, a lot of that is because I am a hip hop fucking fan. Okay, I love oh, it, music. but it was also just a fantastic sound. But in the words varied. of Gats, this motherfucker was a bop. Please don't. I did. Now, as far as the message of the song goes, it's definitely one I agree with putting out there. I'm at a different stage in my life where it's not necessarily applicable to me anymore. Right, but I still have days that this is. <sighs> And I 100% relate to this in the earlier versions of myself. So I the earlier, still get quite younger a bit of Younger me, definitely. Yeah. But I'm now to the point where I'm telling light companies to suck my dick. Right. Well, uh, you know. So I've kind of let loose of the trying to hold myself back. At this point, I'm just going to say right. what's on my mind, and it's going to get me in trouble sometimes. Although, I, like I said, there's days that I feel like this because there are certain people in my life that I still right. won't 100% let loose with. Have I definitely started asserting myself more because I am now allowed to? Yes, but there's also people that, you know, you can't cross that line. Right. So, but I also know some people that could use this song right now. So relatability, I 100%. It, it is one of my favorite sounds from them, but I do love, for me personally... The lyrics of, like, Dark Side is one of my favorites. Welcome to my Dark Side. You know, space around, base, basically fuck around and find out. It's So, Dark Side is, like, the song that, like, so after they fully give in. Right. Now you're in trouble. <laughs> now you fucked around and found out. Right. Right. Just Welcome. To my nightmare. Yeah, I don't serve cookies. Uh, no, I absolutely love these two, yeah. though. They do a fantastic job, song in and song out. Yeah. Uh, I have not heard one song that does not sound amazing. They keep with the same type of genre while varying their sounds quite well. Because I find that in any of these, in this kind of area, you can have beats and instrumentals that end up sounding quite similar. Right. Um, and lyrically, they 100% put themselves into a track. I, I haven't right. found any that are sloppy, like just sort of, oh, this we had a basic idea and then we just, this is what we give you. No, they're, they're all pretty deep in terms of well-written, doubles, good visuals, so on and so forth. Yeah. Yeah, that I'd rather live in a fantasy somebody pay for me. That's fucking fantastic. Right. Well, you know. We've had the discussion of the people just going, I'll pray for you. It's like, <laughs> Dad, don't do a fucking fat thing. load of good that's going to do you, sweetie. <laughs> but you tithe me some money. Um, right. Well, I'm, I'm going to stay the same. So you do you, boo. You do you. Right. <laughs> uh, anyways, so. I'm sure she meant it in both ways in this because some people are well-intentioned. I will give you that. Right. If you guys liked the video, slash that like button, subscribe, ring the bell for notifications, comment down below what did you think of Naomi with the Sanctuary. Also comment down below if there's anything else you guys want to see reacted to, check the description below for all the things. Push our buttons, come join us on our other social media platform. 
<laughs> Especially his Twitter because everyone follows him and not me. Hater. <laughs> Bitter, not hater. We love you guys. Thank you all for watching. Can't wait. Not to even. See, to pray people later. Peace.